Whew, what a day. This is no time for relaxing, Nick. Say, you think WP's got a chance? I guess that really depends on the people we found out about in today's trial. The director and producer? Yeah, them. Well, what are we doing here then? Let's get to the studios. Oh, Mr. Wright, thank you for earlier. Not at all. We got lucky, to tell the truth. You could say that again. Let's not. So, WP, do you have any leads that might get us going in the right direction? Hmm. Sorry, but no. Be sure to tell us anything that comes to mind, no matter how small. We can't rely on getting lucky again tomorrow. Yes. Excuse me. Thank you for showing me that, whatever it is. I wish I could think of some way I could help you. Sorry. <laughs> Do uh, fanboys sneak into the studios often? No, not that I know of. That security lady is pretty strict with them. But in today's testimony, didn't she say they were often hanging around? The kids really, really love to steal samurai. They sneak past when she's not looking, I guess. Was the director present at the morning run-through? Yes, yes he was. He was directing how the steel samurai and the evil magistrate should move. Why didn't you tell us that before? Well, just the studio asked us to keep quiet. That has nothing to do with this. I hate to repeat myself, but Nick here is a newbie lawyer, fresh off the bar. When he loses, he's going to lose big. I... I see. <laughs> Whose side is she on? You aren't hiding anything else from us, are you? No, I sure hope not. No one's here. Right, now that they have Miss Oldbag in custody, I guess they don't have anyone else to replace her. Hey, in the guard station, look, she left her donuts. What? I wasn't going to eat them. Look, it's that assistant girl. Hey! Hi, WP's lawyers, right? I heard about the trial. Great job, guys. Oh? Oh, <laughs> don't mention it. Is it true they caught the security lady? Oh, oh, <laughs> I Actually, she just called me. She told me to cover up that drain. You mean that one? Wow, what a mess. I, I know. And that's not so good with handiwork. So I'm assistant, right? Yeah, but you do work on the props and the backdrops, right? Right. Just lots of times they end up looking worse than they did before I fixed them. Oh? Oh, well, I'm sure these things happen. Nothing to worry yourself about. You're right. I won't. Personally, I think she should worry at least a little bit more. Um, if you'll excuse me, I have to go to the guard station. I was supposed to fill in for Miss Oldbag. Right, see you later then. Good luck with your investigation. So, the fanboy they were talking about in the trial today, he came in through that drain? So it seems. I guess they covered it up in a hurry. Hey, hey Nick! If that drain's covered, the boy won't be able to get in. Uh, yeah, I think that was the idea. I feel kind of sorry for him, though, don't you? What, you want to rip the grate off? Really, Nick? We can? Whoa, she's serious? Uh-oh. 
Well, I guess some things are just made to be broken. Yay! You know, Nick, you're pretty swell sometimes. Sometimes? Hiya! There. That should make the kids happy. Things we do. Oh, hello. Oh, you look a little out of place. It's the clothes, isn't it? I thought my camo vest might do the trick. Kind of an alternative guard fashion thing. So, how are the studios doing? There's police wandering around everywhere. It's terrible. They won't even let me clean up. They'll want me disturbing evidence. I haven't even cleaned up our lunch plates for the day of the murder. You mean those plates with the steak bones left over on them in the employee area? Yeah, can you believe it? Do kids sneak in here a lot? Well, I don't think there's that many of them, but I do see one in particular a bunch. He's always gawking at the sets or snapping pictures. You should see old Windbag's eyes flash when she sees him. She has a bit of trouble catching him, though. I heard something at the trial today. They said that the director and producer were here the day of the murder. Oh, sorry. I was in the prop storage room, so I didn't see them. I guess they were here, though. The studio had seemed pretty eager to keep us quiet. So they were trying to protect the director? Or the producer, really. The producer's our real star here. She saved these studios from the brink of disaster and kept them running. I don't think we'd still be in business if it weren't for that producer. The producer, huh? I'm not really sure what that is, sorry. WTF? Who are you, dude, Chalameo? Huh? We... Wait, you first? Who are you? You look pretty suspicious to me. Whatever, lamers. How did you not know the great Shao Manella? I make the elite shows. The Steel Samurai? Mine. RTFC. Read the film credits. But really? You're the Shao Manella? I'm so sorry. I just... You look so... Sorry. No, no, quite all right. Really, it's fine, ROFL. Well, what is it? You know, on closer inspection. Mmm, yeah. Hot, hot, hot! <laughs> hey, do you do a lot of cosplay? Cause that costume rocks us. Rock swords? What? Hey, you're drooling! Huh? Hmm. <laughs> LOL, buffer overrun. <laughs> it's triggering my creative powers. Yes, yes, it's coming to me. Pink Princess. The sequel to the Steel Samurai. Pink Princess, Warrior of Little Tokyo. ROFL, LMAO. Pink Princess? Why does it gotta be Little Old Tokyo? Why can't I have a cool name like Neo Old Tokyo? Maya, we really need to talk about cool. Did you notice anything unusual on the day of the murder? Oh, I know who you do, Jar. The security lady told you about us, eh? That's right. It was a pretty regular day. We had a run-through for an action scene in the morning. Then a meeting from lunchtime in the studio two later. Heh, <laughs> I was so busy I didn't even get a chance to eat lunch, sad face. A T-bone steak, was it? Yeah, sucksers. I hate missing out on food. Nick, what does sucksers mean? No idea. Anyway, I was in a meeting from noon till after 4 o'clock. Mr. Producer and some bigwigs from the network. Mr. Hammer's time of death was estimated at 2.30 p.m. If he's telling the truth, that meeting gives him an alibi. 
What about the producer who was at the meeting with you? Oh, you mean D. Vasquez? She's a genius. Mad skills all the way. Scary, though. <laughs> she brought these studios back from the brink of destruction. She's the one who made it possible for me to make the Steel Samurai. You had a meeting with her on the day of the murder, right? Yeah, we were together from noon to 4 o'clock p.m. the whole time. Who exactly are these bigwigs people keep mentioning? Oh, the boss over at the network and some sponsors. Also a few production guys. They piled into a limousine and got here right around noon. Major tension. <laughs> were all of them with you the entire time? Yeah, unfortunately. They're all gray-haired geezers. <laughs> hmm, sounds like they'd all be reliable witnesses. I try not to pay much attention to things that don't interest me, lol. Why are you staring at me like that? Hey, Nick! It looks like Detective Gumchu isn't here today. You're right. He's probably up to his neck in paperwork after the commotion at today's trial. So, Nick, remember that Studio 2 we heard about at the trial today? It was down that path of the fallen tree, right? Yeah, I think that's what they said. Maybe the director and the rest of them are there today. Now's our chance, Nick. Let's check it out. This place is deserted. Eh! N Nick, what was that noise? It sounded like it came from inside the trailer. Someone must be inside. Hello? No answer. Pretty suspicious if you ask me, Nick. Let's go in. I'm not sure we should be barging in. Huh, it's locked. What? Don't we have a key? No, but there's probably one in the guard station at the main gate. Then what are we waiting for? Let's borrow it! If they'll let us. Aha! You again! <laughs> How rude, acting like you've seen a ghost! You certainly got back to your post quickly. Oh, the police took me away, they did. They pulled out a steel, steel samurai costume. Told me to put it on, can you imagine? How could I, a sweet little old lady, wear a giant suit like that? Mr. Powers is pretty tall. As soon as they saw there was no way I could wear it, they let me go. I guess that would rule out her being the murderer. Anyway... Know this, whippersnapper. This old lady never forgets a slight or insult. And you won't get any information out of me. My lips are sealed. You sure are talking a lot for someone with sealed lips. Starting now. One, two, three. Mm. This lady's too much. I have a feeling she's not going to respond well to anything I show her now. Um, about that kid you said you saw. If I see him again, I'm taking him down! N Nick, look at her eyes, she's serious! About the director, the one who was here on the day of the murder. If I see him again, I'm taking him down! Nick, I think she's losing it! Hey! Hey, wait! I'll bet he came in right through that drain. Hey, um, Kiddio, what's your name, sport? I'm not a kid, so don't talk to me like that. H huh? But you, you are a kid. What a rude little brat. That's no way to talk to an adult. I don't see no adults here, hippie fashion chick. H hippie fashion... 
Nick, I think I'm being mocked. You gotta hand it to Maya, she's pretty sharp and pretty mad. I'm Cody, Cody Hackins. Call me Kitty O again and I'll cut you down where you stand, evil doer. So, you're a fan of the Steel Samurai? How dare you utter that name, evil doer? What do you mean? We're on Steel Samurai's side. Ha! <laughs> you can't fool me! Okay, then what's the last line said by the innkeeper in episode 8? Ha! <laughs> Easy! Like some fries with that? <laughs> Not bad, Kiddio. Watch it! What are they doing? Say, you heard anything about the incident the other day? You were here, weren't you? Did you see anything? He... He... Hmm? He... Always... The Steel Samurai always wins! Always! Yeah, I saw him! I saw everything! What?! But... But no way am I telling you losers! What? Wait! Let me go! He's gone! Huh? Something fell off the table when he bumped into it on his way out. A bottle? Why was this sitting there, I wonder? Anyway, what was that kid saying? He saw everything. Huh? Where's that old windbag? Ought of her to leave her post. It, hey! Nick! That was her! Stop! Whip a snapper! Y yeah, sounds like she's chasing after that boy. Natch! Uh oh, she tripped! Maya sure looks happy. Hey, hey, Nick! Now's our chance! Let's check out the guard station! Good idea. Oh! This is it, Nick! The trailer key! The key to that trailer in Studio 2! We'll be borrowing this, right, Nick? I wonder if the key we borrowed from the guard station will work. It opened. Great! Let's go, Nick! She seems eager all of a sudden. Well, you first, Nick! Uh, not that eager. Someone's in here. Names. Uh, uh, names? Um, we're WP's lawyers, and, um... I see. And who might you? DeVasquez, the producer. DeVasquez? She's quite beautiful. I'm not interested. I was wondering if you could tell me about the day of the murder. Miss Vasquez? Script. Excuse me? Script. I'm looking for a script. A script? The Steel Samurai episode 13. I need it. Um, could we ask you a bit about the day of the murder? I need to read it. We're getting nowhere fast. Um, we'd really like to ask you about the Steel Samurai. Miss Vasquez? It's on TV every week. That's all I have to say about that. Nick, she's telling us to go watch TV? The nerve of her! Hey, don't get mad at me! 
About the director, Salmonella, was it? What uh, exactly is his role here? Perhaps I did it to make myself clear. I'm looking for a script. I can't be bothered with anything else. Nick? Are all people in the entertainment business this weird? It's starting to look like it. Nick, let's get out of here! Isn't there someplace else we have to check? Y yeah. Wait. Y yes? If you see Manella, give him this. W why do we have to do your errands? I... I don't think I like her. <laughs> don't cry. She'll take it as a sign of weakness. All right. We'll give it to him if we see him. Here, I got this from the producer. Huh? Bring the script for episode 13? Episode 13, where did I put that one? I must have left it somewhere, huh? Uh-oh, my ass is pwned if I don't find it. Uh. Nick! It might be quicker to just look in all the places where he's likely to have been. I agree. We're back at the scene of the crime. Let's find what we need and get out of here quick, Nick. Hey, look! That's the chair the director sits in. I've always wanted to sit in one of these. The director. Maya, take a look around that chair for me, would you? Remember that script the director was talking about? Didn't he say he left it somewhere? Aha! Found it, Nick! The script! Good work! Found your script. Whoop! Thanks. Still, I don't know. That woman needs to be feared when you bring something to her late. Say, um, she think she do she take it down there for me? Thanks. Is that producer really that scary? Well, she's certainly not normal. Here, we found it. Your script. Uh. Um, uh, you're not going to talk to us? Quiet. I'm reading. Huh. Just you hold on. What's the big idea? Who do you think you are anyway? And, and do you even know who we are? Powers is lawyers. Um, right. Am I a suspect? No, it's just, well, no, but... You wanted to know about the day of the murder? Yes, anything you could tell us would be a big help. You know there was a meeting here at noon. Yes, with the director and the people from the network. Correct. 
Now, listen closely. None of the people in this trailer that afternoon fit the Studio One. It was impossible for us to leave. Impossible? Why? The path was blocked. The path? On the day of the murder, the path that leads here was blocked? You saw Mr. Monkey on the way here, correct? Mr. Monkey? The monkey with the broken head. Oh, right, that. What an original name. Its head fell over in the fin of the day of the murder. They didn't start moving the head out of the way until after 3 o'clock. It was after 4 o'clock by the time the path was unblocked. Capiche? Everyone in this trailer was stuck here until the path was clear. Stuck in this trailer. Stuck until after 4 o'clock. Emma died at 2.30. Thus none of us could have gone to Studio One. What? It's true. The crane came just after 3 o'clock and moved ahead. He called some people in to clear the way. I'm sure they corroborate my story. But wait! What if the head fell over after 2.30? Then he could have gone to Studio One. 2.30, the time of death. Very well. Come. That's Mr. Monkey. When it wasn't broken, it announced the time in the ooks. One ook per hour. Ook, 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 ook. Always with the ooking. It is a monkey after all. Check its head. The clock inside stopped when it broke. Huh. Nick, it stopped at 2.15. 215? That's right. This path was blocked from 215 till after 4 o'clock. Therefore, we're innocent. Mr. Hammer died in Studio One at 2.30. See? Goodbye. What do we do, Nick? There isn't anyone besides WP who could have killed Hammer. It's over. We're finished. This sure doesn't look good. Guess we should head back to the office and plan our strategy. Now what? We're fresh out of clues. Everyone's alibi is watertight. We don't even have any promising leads. Things are looking pretty grim. It's a little early for giving up, don't you think? Huh? You've got one lead. M Mia, it's you! What took you so long? Sorry, Phoenix. Maya has trouble calling me unless she's really in trouble. Right. Oh, wait. I guess that means we're really in trouble. I'd say so. What did you mean we have one lead? The boy, of course. Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But, but no way am I telling you, losers. I don't know. He didn't sound like he was going to help us at all. I'm sure you can find some way of bringing him over to your side. Either way, we should get back to the studios. That boy is our last hope, Phoenix. Thanks. Now I'm more worried than I was before. Showing me that isn't going to do any good. You know what they say, dead men don't tell tales. You sure are talking enough. A snapper! She's been chasing that boy this whole time. When, when I catch him, I sounds like she hasn't had any luck catching him. I, I got a hostage now, whipper snapper. A hostage? What's this about a hostage? When that boy was running away. He dropped this, and ran! He'll come back... 
for this one. It's kind of hard to understand her with all that huffing and puffing. Phoenix, that hostage might be what we need. Cody might talk to us if we give him that. Good idea. This old bag, might I- No! I'm catching that brat if it's the last thing I do. Phoenix, do you have anything you might trade with her? Trade? Hmm. I wonder... Hey, that... That's a card. Studio One? Right, the car key to Studio One. I... I can visit Port Hammer. I'd like to visit... He died. Whew. I was his... his fan. You don't have your own card, Miss Olbag? Studio One is in my turf. You'll let me borrow... borrow it, then. If I give her the car key, then I won't be able to get into Studio One. Why don't you let her borrow it, Phoenix? I guess it can't hurt. Here you go, Miss Oldbag. Listen to me, Sonny. I don't like having debts to no whippersnappers. You take this and we're even, deal? What's this? A Steel Samurai trading card? That sneaky kid dropped it. I figure it's pretty important to him, though. Thank you. I may have a use for this. This must be the hostage she's talking about. Right, I'm off. There she goes, hobbling off toward the studio. Hey! Hey, you! Wait a sec! Phoenix, was that the boy? Yeah, his name's Cody Hackens. I think he ran into the dressing room. He's sure to be in here somewhere. Found you! Ah. Damn it! He's getting away! Come back! There, he's back. How did she... Hey there, would you mind helping us out? Please? Uh, I'm Cody. Hello, Cody. I'm Mia. Mia Fang. Nice to meet you. Yo! And I'm Phoenix Wright. Who asked? Phoenix, you can take it from here. I'm not so sure I'm qualified. Steel Samurai is so cool. I think he's the, um, the bomb. Ha! <laughs> what would a lamer like you know about the Steel Samurai? Hey, watch that attitude. Phoenix, you really shouldn't yell like that. He's only a kid. Yeah, don't yell like that. I'm only a kid. So, do you know anything about what happened here? Could you tell me, please? I don't know nothing. Hmm, looks like a little persuasion's necessary. Maybe a bribe. Cody, this look familiar? Hey! Why, you are! You are... huh? You are, you know, ultra rare? That card's really hard to get! Man, for a grown-up, you sure are dumb! I'll give you this, if you help me. But that's my card! By offering me something on your own, you are in effect showing the very basis of our consumer society, namely the principle of fair trade! Man, for a grown-up, you sure are dumb! What do they teach these kids in school these days? Quantum physics? Whatever, I don't need that card. Huh? I got a double. Just keep it. It's yours. What? After I went through all that trouble? If you want to trade, find me a really rare card. Really rare? You mean there's something rarer than ultra rare? 
Ultra rare premium cards are way rarer than plain ultra rare cards. Come on! Man, for a grown up, you sure are dumb. Premium rare. Why do I feel like we're talking about steaks? Oh, hi. Hello. What brings you here? Oh, well, I had to arrange some stuff. Um, yes? The, um, girl with you, doesn't she seem a little different? Like, is she even the same person as before? Um, nope. She's the same as always. Same as always. Okay, whatever you say. Have you seen that boy since then? Nope. You missed it, though. The security lady was chasing around at the boy so fast I thought she collapsed. Of course, he got away in the end. Boy, was she mad. Actually, we saw them. How's the old windbag doing? She was squeezing donuts through her clutched fist back at the guard station. Some people take their jobs a little too seriously. Are all the posters on the wall here of Hammer? Yes. It's really a terrible loss for the studios. But its popularity had been waning recently, right? That's true. Then again, after what happened... After what happened? You mean you don't know about Hammer? No, what? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said anything. Wait, now you have to tell me. What happened with Hammer? I'm sorry. I'm probably not the one who should tell you. Uh-oh. Why do I get the feeling something's being covered up here? Do you know anything about this? Hey, that's a Steel Samurai trading card. I collect those, actually. I'm one card away from a complete set. A complete set? Yeah, a set of one of each card. Huh. Wait. Wait, 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 wait! That's it! That's the card I need! You don't know how long I've been looking for it! Uh... I don't care what kind of girl you might think I am, I need that card! P please! I beg you! Please trade with me! Trade with you? Yes, trade cards! Look, I'll even trade you an ultra-rare premium card! Trade me a... Huh? Yes, it's a good deal for your ultra rare. Please! Phoenix, can't you see she's desperate? What's everybody getting so excited about? Okay. Really? Th thanks. Then this is for you. Yahoo! And there she goes. Does doing good things like that make you feel great? Yeah. Yeah, it does. See this card? Yeah, so- Wait! That's it! That's the last ultra rare premium card I need! Come on, give it to me, please! You gotta give it to me! Wow, I've never seen him so eager. Right, okay, how about a trade? You're on! I'll give you a samurai spear and throw in an evil match straight to boot. No, 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 not that kind of trade. I don't want cards, I want information. Huh? You sure? Fine by me? Okay, Phoenix, let's hear what he has to say. If he knows something that can help us, we can have him take the stand tomorrow. It's 
So, you like to steal samurai? He's so cool! I... I guess. You're judging him by his looks! You have to look at his actions, at his life! I'm being lectured on life by a great schooler. You like him too, don't you? Uh, oh, me? Yeah, I am love the Steel Samurai. So, tell me what your favorite thing about the Steel Samurai is. Gotta think of something. I like it when he, uh, he vanquishes his foes. Yeah, wazam! The Steel Samurai always wins. Always. Check this out. It's my fan album. What the? It's all pictures of the Steel Samurai. I go to every live performance. Those stupid publicity stunts where they beat each other up in public? I always take a picture when the Steel Samurai lands the final blow. With Sam! I caught them all! I never missed one! A perfect collection! Check it out! My new digital camera! Wow, that's very impressive. The newest model, isn't it? You bet, lady! I just got it for my birthday! My album has a name, wanna hear it? The Steel Samurai Path to Glory! The Steel Samurai always wins! Always! Hey, if you want this, you can have it, lady. Really? Are you sure? Yeah, I took these with a digital camera. I got all the data at home, so I can always make another one. Well, then I'm happy to accept. Thank you. What's with people always giving stuff to Mia? What a life. Huh? You were here on the day of the incident, right? Yeah. Did you see anything unusual? Cody. <laughs> Cody, he needs to know because he's fighting for justice. Isn't that the Steel Sam Rise motto? For great justice? You have to help us fight for great justice, too. I... I saw... I saw everything! Well, well. We might get some useful information out of him yet. Cody, I need to ask you something very important. What did you see on the day of the incident? I got here that day around 2 o'clock. I had to come in through the woods out back so that old lady wouldn't see me. I got kind of lost, though. I was in there for maybe a half hour or so. And I finally got to the studio. After that... What is it, Cody? Th this steel samurai killed the bad guy. He used his samurai spear. Just like always. One shot, one kill. It happened so fast. I got scared. I went home after that. I... I see. It must have been hard for Man, you. Man, you say those nice things, but it's so obvious you weren't speaking from the heart. Um, right. Mia? Yes? I think we can say for sure this means the Steel Samurai did it. True enough. And the director has an alibi, so it wasn't him. Indeed. So, the only person left to it could have been his Will Powers. I have to admit, it's kind of a shock. But if you put this boy in the witness stand, your client will be guilty for sure. Let's not call him then. I think that would be wise. Best to leave this one alone. Not so fast, pal! I heard everything! This boy here is a key witness, and he's under police protection starting now. Come on, son. You've got a rendezvous with me down at the precinct. No, I ain't going. What? <laughs> that didn't go so well. We're back to zero leads. And now we have a serious handicap in court. What are we going to do, Mia? Well, hmm, I really need to be going. Don't worry, Phoenix. I'm sure you'll be fine. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come to the trial tomorrow, please. I need you there. Phoenix, can I ask you something? Do you really believe that Mr. Powers is innocent? Of course he is. That's all I wanted to hear. Excellent. I'll see you in court then. Great! Thanks, Mia. See you soon. <laughs>